Hello everybody, welcome uh, to the SAP Supply Chain Management Basic videos. Now in this session, the objective is to see how to cancel a material document with respect to MyGo. We have already seen how to cancel a material document with respect to MBST, the traditional way. Now we will be seeing how to cancel a material document through MyGo. So uh, for that, first of all, let's go into MyGo. Let's pick up a metal document. So I'm going into display, a metal document. So let me press enter. Okay, now here, if you look at the couple of most important things. Uh, here, this is the quantity of the material. This is a storage location, raw material hyphen VIL. And you can see here, the movement type is 101 plus. This means that it was actually a goods receipt with respect to the purchase order into the warehouse yeah you can see here so 101 is nothing but it is good receipt for purchase order into the warehouse so that means it uh, it was actually added up to the inventory so my expectation is that if i cancel this middle document the inventory that has been added up that should be removed or it should be revoked so now here the movement type should be 102 and uh instead of plus it should be minus all right now the plant is 1000 same thing so this is the material T half in BW02 half in 01 and the quantity is one. And uh, this is a plant and this is a storage location. So it should be 102 minus from the same plant and same storage location. That is thousand and then BRAW, right? Uh, and the WM, you can see here, it is the purchase order number, basically dynamic storage bin. It, it is acting as a dynamic storage bin right now. Okay, now if I documents, if you can see here, so it is 521265550 minus. So here it has been added up to the inventory raw material and goods received as 550 minus and expense and the freight clearance. So if I'm going to cancel this, this should be negative, this should be positive, this should be negative, and this should be positive. Basically, it's a common logic that it will be all reversed right so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to just cancel it so to cancel this you have to select a03 cancellation same middle document number i'm just going to press enter so now you can see here it has picked up the same storage location same material and if you look at the quantity it's the same quantity where it's the same plant and same storage location same bin basically but it will pick up the prioritization right now uh, because it will ask that how it should be removed that's why so now this is the purchase order number if you look at it is the same purchase order number and here the most important thing is the moment type you can see here it is 102 and here it is negative so that means it is going to be goods receipt with respect to purchase order reversal now what we have to do is we just have to say item okay check there is nothing everything is okay and then just post that's it so it's save you can see here metal document posted now i'm going to see the metal document so here same thing a04 display same metal document number so you can see here it is for the same material T hyphen BW02 hyphen 01, same quantity 1, and uh, where the same plant and the same storage location. And the most important thing is the moment type is 102 negative. Now let's go and see the document info. So this is my documents, accounting document. So you can see here it has all reversed. So 52126 was positive there, it is negative here. 550 was negative there and it is positive here. So this is something like all the entries will be reversed. So whatever has been positive there, it will be negative here and whatever is positive there, negative there, it will be positive here. So that's how it works. So that means it has actually reversed all the entries. So that means the goods receipt is being reversed. This is how you would be canceling a middle document uh, with the help of MyGo. Um, Thanks for watching this video on SAP Supply Chain Management. Please do subscribe to our channel and motivate us. Thank you so much.